The Swedish company Hart Aerospace initially designed a 19-seater plane called as the ES-19. This was small and was only made for the Nordic markets. But when the plane was unveiled, it not only impressed the local market, it also gained attention from big companies of Europe, New Zealand, Canada and the US. What we started as a local niche product had a global appeal. This was said by Anders Forsland, the CEO of Hart Aerospace. In order to produce aircrafts for these big companies, Hart Aerospace needed to comply with various regulations. So, they came up with a better version called as the ES-30. The fully electric version offers range of up to 125 miles while the other two hybrid variants offer up to 250 and 500 miles. This 30-seater aircraft has quite a unique seating, offering two and one seating configuration. The aircraft can cruise at an altitude of 20,000 feet. The ES-30 only requires 1100 meters of runway length, which is great because any similar aircraft of this size, like the Embraer EH-135, needs at least 1400 meters of runway length. The extreme efficiency and and the design gained attention of many big companies. The well-known Air Canada ordered 30 of these flying machines, and the Sweden-based company Rocktenair also signed the letter of intent. The companies that initially ordered the ES-19 have also been converted to the ES-30, which include orders from Air, Iceland Air, Soundsair, Asa Airlines, and the well-known United Airlines. The plans for certification of this aircraft is in 2028, which means a proof-of-concept aircraft might get rolled out in 2024 and the aircraft's test flight in 2026.